Hello everybody and welcome to the first episode of The Wolf Among Us. Now, I did play the first bit, but some of the footage was missed out so I didn't think I'd show you it. I'm sure you've seen it on other people's channels, you can go check it out on theirs. Basically, I had a fight with the woodcutter, and there was this girl, and she said goodbye wolf, and there was a frog. And he needs a glamour basically, because if you know a bit about this game, you have to have glamours to hide that you are a fable and he can't afford one so I basically had to talk about to him about that because he couldn't afford one and he doesn't like me that much because I destroyed his car and stuff so yeah because I fell on his car after the fight basically she's got a ribbon around her neck we don't know about that what that is yet and she's walked off and she kissed us on the cheek so that's okay I suppose <laughs> anyway let's start the first part that you guys will see Game presents. Ooh. That's quite cool. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. You see, this game's on offer for ten pound on PS4, so I bought it so I could play through it and show you everybody. seems really cool, it's the only Telltale game I haven't played. And we're about to get started. Episode 1, Faith. Back at my house. Sounds pretty nice. Ooh, we're walking around. What's this thing? I'm guessing I have to use. Is this one of those things that you? What is it? Luxury apartments. Wish they wouldn't advertise that. Mm hmm. So they're obviously not luxury apartments. How do I get, How do I get in? Oh, I pressed the wrong red. Right. Yeah, now you can see how stupid I am. <laughs> it was red, <laughs> not pink. Oh, I feel dumb now. Anyway, no, we won't make that mistake next time. Let's go. What? Come on out. Beauty and the Beast. Oh well. I wasn't expecting anyone. I know this looks a little odd, but there's an explanation. Why'd you hide when I walked up? Well, I didn't know who it was. You can't be too careful these days. You? No, can't. She's right. I'm late. I just got in a fire or nothing. I almost died.
he's not awake. Grimble. What a name. He's not waking up. Been a while since I got mail. Seven day in a row. You. Black beard. Corner. Oh, my God. Shoot the elevator. I love how they incorporate all of them. Here we go. Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Beauty? So, have you? I'm staying out of it. Out of what? Whatever it is, Beast. I'm not a marriage counselor. Damn it. Something's going on. I made a bad decision there. <laughs> Let's see what's in the fridge. Or the freezer in that case. Nothing in there. Oh, what got to eat? Oh, huff puff. Yeah. That's probably a good idea. Bluebeard's file. Who's Bluebeard? Look at the Chinese food. Don't even remember ordering that. Probably a bad sign. <laughs> Should help. Oh, what? Why have we got a pig? I'm in your chair, huh? I've only got the one. So yeah. smoke
That should have been a choice. Line. Thanks. A couple thousand more of these. We'll be even on that house you owe me. House has got to stop. You can't keep sneaking off the farm like this. The fresh air and sunshine pitch they sell you on is bullshit. I didn't escape out of the homelands to end up in some prison, okay? Don't send me back there, Bigby. You don't know what it's like, okay? You haven't been there. Calm down. I'm not sending you back. That for me? Nope. The house didn't blow itself down, Bigby. That's all I'm saying. Oh, Do it's... with that what you will. Now, I'm not saying it's, it's reason enough survived. for you. definitely been offered a drink, but, uh... It would have helped ease some of the pain you once caused me, yes. Oh, it's the big reboot of house town. I completely forgot about that. You are now. If that was all you were saying, I'd be able to get some rest. I take it all back. This is why everyone hates you. It is better to be feared. Said that? Yeah, some sad asshole. Eating alone. But, uh, no, um, hate's the wrong word. They fear you more than anything. You ate a lot of people back in your day. I thought we were all supposed to have a fresh start here. I can't change the past. Well, you can't change people's memories either. Yeah. Look, I'm not saying it's fair, but it's real. People are scared of you. I mean, look at your hands. <laughs> Just covered in blood, like you get in a fight with a fable, right? I'm sure you're not going around punching Mondays. I was doing my job, believe it or not. Your job is to beat the shit out of fables. Sometimes I take them to the farm. Fuck you. I didn't want to say that. You think my job is easy? You try keeping a bunch of fables from killing each other. How do you think this all works? I don't know. How? By being big and being bad. By being big and being bad. Don't say that shit in front of people. It's embarrassing. That's the attitude that gets you in trouble. I'm sure you were shitty to everyone you came across tonight. Right, I'm going to leave the episode there, so I'll see you guys in the next one, should be out very, very soon, so see you.